1972, ore miners unknowingly discovered an ancient anomaly in the radioactive uranium mined at Oklo in Gabon, Africa. Samples of this material were sent to French physicist Francis Parent, who investigated and realized the uranium ore sample he'd analyzed contained a slightly lower percentage of uranium-235 than typical. Further investigation into this discrepancy revealed other radioactive isotopes present in the ore, specifically products of fission that could only be generated from a significant nuclear reaction. What was most interesting about the Oklo site is that the uranium ore collected from the mine contained fission products that, when dated, placed the origin of the reactor at nearly 2 billion years old. In 1956, a nuclear scientist named Paul Kuroda postulated that natural nuclear reactors could exist on Earth under certain conditions. Just 16 years after his prediction, the first natural fission reactor was located. The site at Gabon acted similarly to a light water reactor and produced around 100 kilowatts of thermal energy, comparable to running 20 to 30 air conditioning units. The natural reactor operated for several hundred thousand years and is still the only site known to have produced natural fission. Today, most of the natural reactor has been mined away, though efforts in the late 90s were made to partially preserve what little remains for further study.